It really is built for a fantastic playoff final. There's no doubt about it. I think they're the two teams that deserved to get there overall, considering what they've done this season. And um, I think it'll be a feast of football because they've got goal scorers in both teams. Um, they're attacking sides. And, and in the open spaces of Wembley, it could certainly be a cracking game. How important do you think the return of Niall Quinn was tonight, Ray? Missed a couple of matches, but Quinn and Phillips have been a terrific combination, haven't they? Certainly have. A bit like Tosha and Keegan, yeah. isn't it? You know, uh, the little and large. But I think uh, you've got... ...in the final against Sunderland. They were at home to Ipswich. A goal up from the first leg. The commentator is Rob Palmer. Strong defending by the experienced Bowen to race, which is just about won by Cundy. Now Bright! Oh, excellent save by Richard Wright. Bright stopped by Wright. Eight red shirts in and around the penalty box. Healy goes long. Yowds heads it back, the goalkeeper rooted to his line. Rufus goes up, oh, what a save by Wright! Incredible, and how on earth did he keep that out by Bright? Matthew acts quickly, good shot by him, good save by Sasa Illich. Excellent piece of play from Newton. Tiptoes through the defence and scores a wonder goal! He took the ball in his step, seemed to have completely lost his balance, beat one, two, three defenders with hardly any drawback, fired an absolute bullet! So Alan Kerbishner sends the central defenders forward. Yams goes up and he gets a header to the ball. He was denied only by a piece of wood. And the full-time whistle goes, and Charlton Athletic are heading from the valley to the Twin Towers of Wembley. They've outfought, they've outbattled, they've outfought at Switch Town tonight. A slightly relieved-looking Alan Kirbishley, but I don't think on the performance of his players he was ever in any doubt. A wonder goal from Sean Newton. He scored a playoff goal against Crystal Palace back in 1996, two years ago. Wasn't as good as tonight. Will tonight lead Charlton Athletic to the promised land of the Premiership? Every one of their players has battled extremely hard tonight, buoyed on by a fantastic support for old George Burley. He's lifted the side from the doldrums mid-season to the brink of the playoffs final. Eddie out a former Intwitch player, applauds both sets of fans. Didn't score tonight, hit the post and looked to have scored against the side he was promoted with back in 1992. But it's a credit to the Charlton players and their magnificent support that they're all heading to Wembley. The final score at the Valley tonight, Charlton Athletic 1, Ipswich 0. They go to Wembley by virtue of a 2-0 aggregate score. So Charlton's fantasy season continues. Clive, they're just unstoppable at the moment. They are. I think they've put a tremendous run together, unbelievable run to get this far. And I think that um, I did say I felt it would be the away performance that would win this tie. It was so difficult to call. And I felt that they had the upper hand from that 1-0 victory at Ipswich on Sunday. And they did that tonight, Ray, without their leading goal scorer, Clive Mendonca. Oh, it's an awesome performance again, isn't it? Uh, it's all set up for Wembley. Uh, Mendonca hopefully will be back. And he's a great asset to them. I think Alan Kerbisley deserves a lot of credit just before... The